is white. Let's go. E4, E5. Knight of 3, Knight 6. Hey, he's still there. How are you doing? You just come on time. The arena is starting in about 14 minutes. There we go. You're free to join on time. We have the link here. And also use your... Yep. Uh, you should not gonna win. <laughs> and then... You can use also the prediction. Currently, we uh, check out Capablanca games. It should be 5. Knight f6. Castle. Bishop e7. Uh, knight c3, d6. Bishop takes 6. B takes e6. B4, e takes d4. And takes d4. Bishop d7. We should do five. Not so much notes here because it's a pretty long theory. Rook e1. If you have any questions, just let me know. But bishop h4. Bam knight h7. Black start maneuvering. Looking for more training of, of the pieces. Uh, queen d3. We go rook b8. B3. Push. Knight goes back to g5 to get this pressure or exchange a bit more pieces c5 could be very very dangerous because give up the d5 square maybe in the stream topic we should mention capablanca yeah to not ask me hundred times capablanca lesson uh done should update it um, 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 um. all right there we go my g5 queen e5 oh sorry wait my g5 uh look 81 and before that we have little little um text about so seems like uh next move of uh, black is not that common like uh my g5 um <laughs> Doom Satcher. Yeah, he won the battle yesterday. He won the battle. He won an amazing game yesterday. Uh in general supposed to be a little before here. Rookie 8 is not the Wow wow wow. And rookie 8 followed by knight of fate, knight e6, e the knight g6. This is the classical maneuver of but here we have a little bit uncommon continuation. So, rookie 8 is the most common continuation and probably continue with the theory. Uh, 9g5, there we go. Um, rook d1 by Capablanca. Centralize everything using the central strategy. Everything looks super, super natural. Um... For queen e5, queen e3, knight e6, knight c e e2, queen a5. Uh, so the plan for black here is start attacking quite on the queen side part. Uh, at the same time, trying to uh, provoke him to push any of those pawns and pushing of the pawns ahead could be a kind of mistake. Uh, no, I never test myself. I'm scary. Hey, Mr. Warren. I know you're the most clever person ever in the chat here, maybe, but who cares? <laughs> we are here to, to enjoy with the chess and make fun. Um... How high? Thank you. Grandmasters have generally. You can ask Hikaru. You can ask uh, Mrs. Bottes or whatever. I never test my IQ. Uh, let's say maybe I'm not so intelligent. So yeah, feel free. Feel free to test me. <laughs> to check out, to confirm that. Um, for instance, I hate uh, history. I hate uh, some deep literature, I hate some more geography, I hate uh, some more complicated names, so, so it's kind of more or less connected with the history, so I guess um, 
some complicated mathematic exercises what are not connected with my array so why i should know everything in this life so i'm thinking like that so i'm uh interested let's say of crypto let's go for the crypto to study crypto i'm interested of chess let's try to be hot um Let's try to be hot, uh, interested in, in chess, like following top events. So you cannot, um, I think so you cannot know everything, you know. Um, so I guess it should be the best in your array, not in all the arrays. I know such a phil philosophy. <laughs> when, I was, uh, uh, when I was in the university, the, there is a lady and she came with the four, with the four educations. In, in the sport academy and this was the fifth one you know um but you know she does looks like iq was so super high you know uh so only finishing so many university also it's not a guarantee that you're gonna be so clever you know <laughs> uh he got set 102 test on stream no <laughs> <laughs> yeah it could be uh no i just gave example if you're interested in crypto just go to check out crypto if um uh, for instance now i ordered six seven books what i want to read about uh business they, they're pretty old books uh pretty gold books what all the people recommend them so um I, i'm interested in that how, how let's say businessmen are, are thinking of was the way was the approach what's what's the technique uh, you know it's not only about investments but how they're thinking too in a different situations different examples i'm just curious to know more about that how they develop from zero or such a kind of uh, stories could be fake could be a real one you never know but i'm more interested in this area lego at four <laughs> yeah i at four i destroyed the pieces i have uh, shared with you probably this story but at four and a half years old i have uh, destroyed the pieces on the board when my brother was playing with my father and i said come on stop paying attention to my brother who is eight years older than me and please pay attention to me too uh i want to play too <laughs> and that was the whole beginning of my chess career yeah <laughs> character strong character um okay let's go knight d now we currently have a situation where uh white is attacking you on a2 the question is do you need to pay attention to the a2 pawn or you can think about um any counter attack Okay, so knight f5 by white side. Um, but still, I cannot say that I reached so much in, in my chess career. Uh, I wish... <laughs> I wish to uh, have much more, of course. I wish to have much more, but that's the real thing. Maybe uh, every single person is having any limitation, any border to reach on. And now, uh, to be fair, I'm much more happy even into the coaching of giving lessons. Uh, that's that's passion and that's giving me inspiration to see results of others, to see good results of others and so on. Um... <laughs> yeah, why not? Okay, 95, there we go. Uh... So now I'm gonna ask you what's going on after Queen takes A2 chat. Why this is bad move? Uh, the move in the game, by the way, is a knight e c5. There we go. From outline. Why knight takes a2 is a trash move. There we go. It's your turn. Also, I like cooking. Currently, I prepared three kinds of meats for tomorrow. We have uh, to continue the celebration <laughs> from Tuesday. Your coach in the gym. Let's see people pro. Yeah, uh, me either. Let's see uh, people progress in the tournaments and so on.
Hey, Ricardo. Yeah, could be. We see the rookie one. Trap the queen. Hey, John. Oh, yeah. John is all right. Queen c3. Do I have time to escape? What's up if I am escaping here? Can we keep going? Okay, so tar. I gotta have this space. I'm answering to your question. What's going on after EB1? Hey, hey, Captain Logis. How are you doing? Feel free to join our run on time. Please. Let's go. So, I'm currently asking you what's going on. What's going on if... Uh, Somebody is accepting the pawn. It's not happening in this game of Capoblanca, but what's up if it's ever happened? Everyone is welcome to join in this arena. 90 minutes so far, 3 plus 2 time control. Doesn't matter who is the winner. Doesn't matter who is the winner. I wish to see a match between number 1 and number 2. When the, when the tournament is finishing, 3 out of 5, 3 plus 2. So feel free to, to show me what is your compensation after losing A2 pawn. Hey, hey, Purple Rose. Thank you so much. Deep appreciated. Thank you so much. Rook d3, rook g3, knight f4. I'm still waiting for more, more, more ideas. I already find it. You already find out the correct continuation. <coughs> Sorry, the pen is in front of me. Uh, I pasted also the link in Facebook, Twitter, and two, and let's go this one too. Yeah, thank you. Okay, last links to join up. Tournament is starting soon. I'll be glad if everyone joined. Alright, there we go. Prediction is still on the way. Captain Logis and Sotar are in, so feel free to vote for yourself at least that you're gonna win the arena. 94. Actually, 94 is deflecting the knight because boom! Checkmate on G7. Yes, it is 94. Of course it is. 94 F6. Can you keep going with attacking moves, please? But it's only 6 yeah. This is a general threat, but what's next? Go, 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 go! 9g6. What was it, 9g6? I simple move rookie 8. I didn't get it. He's doing 9g6, not so much. If it wasn't for chess, maybe I would have a better chance. <laughs> Yeah, let's let, let's make a Bagamon tournament. Am I supposed to go for a Bagamon tournament? Yeah, can I stream Bagamon tournament? <laughs> but I'm not sure which website we 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 are allowed to use. I'm scared of some restrictions. <laughs> so there isn't in the arena. Wait. Is he into the prediction? Oh, wait. He can join in the last moment. He can join after 30 minutes. It's his job. It's not ours. <laughs> yeah. Okay, so... Knight h5, queen g3. There we go. We've got the move. Why queen g3? Because we're go we still... Half pressure G7 plus 96 H6 96 deflection. Deflection, there we go. G5, push. Now we move for somebody of you set. I think slash 96, yeah. Rook F7. I think H6. It's very, very easy now. 
And I had a similar situation before. So if king takes f7, the second. So this is the move in the game. But if king takes f7, what's the way to um, not lose the second knight? Is there a way to not lose the second knight? How to keep going? It's not a shirt, it's a dress, by the way. I'm sexy and I know it. <laughs> it's not a shirt, it's it's a dress. Oh. Like, I'm very, very... I do have a dinner, but it, it's a nice dress, I guess. It's one of my favorite. Um, <laughs> so hard to say. Looking it's good. a shirt, it's a dress. <laughs> F4, push. Push because if you capture, we have a great counter attack by f5. So if not, anyway, we will push f5 and cover the knight. All right, this is the move in the game. What about the other knight now? So it's so simple, maybe. Use your imagination because the king is pretty naked now on the king side part. We can destroy, eliminate the position, open up much more. f4 now is not working. D6 or E5. Oh yeah, Captain Ketchup. Uh, Captain Ketchup. The king needs a dress. Oh yeah, king is pretty naked. He needs a dress. I'm very good at Bagamon also, by the way. I'm very good at Belot. I like also Texas Hold'em, but just for fun, of course. Otherwise, I'm very, very addicted to battle. I try to control myself. Not like in chess when I lose the game, but <laughs> better hope so. <laughs> uh, rook b7. Push. It's all about destroying. What's mean destroying? Push pawns, capture, trade off. That's mean destroying. Uh, provoke opponent to push and so on. And now, white must win the game. That's the comment uh, afterwards. Boom, <laughs> Okay, let's go back to the game chat. Knight f5 so far. He didn't take. He played knight c5. Knight e d4. Let's activate the other knight. King h7 so far. It was a nice threat. Boom. Bishop takes. Knight takes e6. Bishop takes e6. Knight e7. Four key. Yeah. King h7. Does look like so promising king h7, the ducking is continuing, and now we have an interesting move. Don't forget about going for prediction, please. And this is the arena link if you forgot about join on time. We have a very, very interesting move now by white side. Today I drank in about three, four coffees, no, maybe three, and three, four cup of teas. <laughs>
right, let me see. Do you have any suggestions for the white's continuation chart? Coco Blanca is by white. Oh yeah, Master Zlech. Master Zlech tonight is in an excellent mood. Play like Coco Blanca. G4. Excellent. Rook E8. F3. Support E. Support the center. Knight E6. Knight D E2. Queen takes A2. So Knight E2. This this is retreating because um white is trying to keep as much as possible pieces on the board of course and uh use them into the king side attacking next move is super natural so i will not even asking you of course connect the knights um queen b6 maybe was more playable for black trying to exchange the queens uh this move but white is still better in, in, even into the eventual end game. g3 a2 d c1. Oh no, wait. Knight e2, knight g3. Uh huh. A queen takes c2. Wow, so black even captured this pawn. Um. Rook c1, queen b2, knight h5, activity, that's such a natural continuation. Two pawns down on the queen side part, but we can simple uh, share that we throw away these pawns for initiative on the king side part. Um, so, knight h5, rook h8. many lines here mm -hmm. move 25 it's interesting by the way not so much but if g6 4 key we have queen takes h6 king g8 and now um there is a pork there is a covering of g7 checkmate so what's supposed to be white's continuation Also, also, queen covers a very important square too. But what's supposed to be the white's continuation here if you have to continue this kind of attacking? E5. Wait a second, Mr. Ketchup maybe is knowing the game? Do you know the game, man? Do you know the game? Mr. Ketchup is knowing the game. Amazing Mr. Ketchup tonight. Amazing. E5. <laughs> wow. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Did you open up the game or the book? Oh man. Don't cheat. G takes H. G takes H. And White is winning. Follow by King H1, Rook G1. Looks crushing attack against the King side part. Hey Dr. Osip. Happy to see you. And this is how white save up the uh, knights. The whole idea of e5 is actually disconnect the queen from covering g7 square, e the knight f6 checkmate eventual. Yeah. <clears throat> uh, you cannot directly jump there. That's the whole plan of e5. We currently have arena. Everyone must join. Please feel free to join arena. There we go. It's out of the fine club. You know the classical games. You mean you know them like your 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 name or what? You know them uh, <laughs> in an excellent way, actually. Okay. Uh, so very very good uh, continuation here. G six probably. G six. So. There we go. C2, rook C1, rook B2, and H5. Rook H8 is the move in the game. A little bit more. 
We're finished with this game. We're to queen e5, though. f4. Queen b5. That's a process he studied and remember those games. Yeah, Harry Bows. Yes. I said just when younger. <laughs> That's awesome. Yeah. Queen b5. Probably I, I also have studied this kind of games, but probably I forgot. <laughs> so. Um, I'm not sure if you share with us the true or not, but uh, so, some people are having a photography memory. I think Magnus Karosin is having such a kind of memory. Um, yeah. <laughs> he is Mirster. All right, Queen B5. It's a white turn. Let's go. Again, use your imagination. Oh! It's a pretty long game though. Four pages. Four pages so far. Wait, what? Oh no 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 no. Sorry, it's about three pages only. Whoa! I think we have a checkmate by Paul in the end, chat, so try to be active. <laughs> try to be active. Hey it's me, sir. We have currently arena. Here we go. Knight h6 is interesting. Let's try to go a little bit deeper if you decide, if you show me any sacrifice. Try to go a little bit deeper. Why? What's going on next? And so on. Wow, it's so much raining outside. <laughs> Cloudy. I'm waiting for fresh suggestions by White here. Position looks like uh, domination into the O points on the kingside part by White. So many push, pushing of the pawns. Uh, so much space, you know. Thank you, Mister. We're not used to this. Knight FG7. Knight G7. You say 97, which knight? Uh, what's going on if I capture twice? 96, g takes f6, queen h3. Maybe that's why they bring the rook to h8. So, if Sultar sacrifice just like that, uh, I think. Uh, first of all, queen g7 is not a checkmate, so I can't even think about captured rook. I'm not sure, but. Yeah, we, we can compare with Mr. Engine too. Yep, definitely. I can do that. Doesn't work, Sultar variation. Can check out now the next one. Knight FG7. Congratulations! You play like Capablanca. <laughs> Make myself bigger to height. Uh, eventual engine coming to you. All right, Knight FG7. What's up if I capture chat? What's going on if I capture? Knight f6. Uh, knight f6, king g6. It's about plus two. Is there anything better than knight f6? No. Okay. Knight f6, king g6. Yeah. G5? Wow. Are you playing for a mate? Oh, g5, hg, fg, don't forget about I have a queen here too. Or save up the bishop and then queen hg5. I don't see if you have in advance check. After g5 I take and steal your knight's hanging. So just play simple chess. Um, you already break through, capture a very important pawn um, of opponent. So, and also sacrifice a piece, don't forget about that. So the next step after you sacrifice a minor piece has to be any kingside attacking, any checkmate pattern, or take back the piece. <laughs> Knight takes d7, of course. Take back the piece. Followed by f5 check, and then you can bring the knight back. Gonna be checkmate if king h7, though. So knight takes f5. Um, where I am? Ah, actually, we don't have this variation if opponent accepts. This is just our imagination. Yeah. 
the opponent didn't accept after knight fg7, he simply bring the knight back to c5. Which is also much more catastrophic. Um, yeah, true here, of course. And now the domination is completely uh, crystal clear advantage here. Yeah? F6, we simply take here as force as possible, bring the knight back with the same mating net. Rook G8, push, King G5. We need three. It has to be something like um, <laughs> tactics. Find out the long mate. Engage four. All right, mate in two, chat. Mate in two. Now it's your turn. I'm not sure we're gonna have time for one more game. Because games are pretty long. Maybe we just cover one game. Mate in two. Oh, yeah. That's what I was talking about. Push. Checkmate by Pong. Excellent by Capablanca. Excellent job. Very, very short game so far. 30 moves so far. Add to the library of Capablanca 12 games so far. We have Arena in about... In about... Seven... Th th no. In about eight minutes. Something like that. Seven, eight minutes. I'm not sure exactly. So, feel free to join. I think we 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 can try to go for um oh, this game is very very nice we, we can try to go for one more game bam 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 set up a position capablanca bern next game is between capablanca bern capablanca bern 1911, the same year. Right. We have Spanish game or Rui Lopez. We call it in my country also Spanish game. C6. It should be 5. A6. Classical line. Long theory in Rui Lopez, as usual. D3. Magnus Carlsen used to play D3 system. Um. Bernstein. No, it's not Bernstein. This time it's just Bern. The previous guy was Bern <laughs> Bernstein. 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 And this guy is just a Bern. I'm not sure if it's the same game. Uh, I mean, if it's the same match. Could be the same match, no? no but the next one is Janowski. I I'm not sure if this is the same person. It's written just Bern. <laughs> just Bern. Uh, D3, D6. I know that Magnus Carlsen used to play this against Rui Lopez very often. We transpose to Rui Lopez, Morphe Defense, Anderson Variation, D6, C3. It should be 7. We start talking about soccer. We have a soccer, in, soccer channel in Discord, so you can simple. Uh, You don't know the game if it's burn. Okay. Um, <laughs> I cannot be sure. It's written burn. I guess they write down on uh, the full name. <laughs> B5, bishop c2. And white is hurry up to go over that. And uh, hurry up to maneuver first the knight. Transpose him. Classical maneuver. Transpose him to the king side part through knight g3. As usual. Maneuver bishop e6, knight e3, e the knight g3. A little bit later to decide where to go for castling, but the most common castling in Rui Lopez is kingside castling. Please don't make an experiment when there is eventual open b or a file. Please. Rook e8, castle, queen e7, prediction is over, tournament is coming. Knight d5. White is ready based on this pin to step on his neck in the center. There we go, knight d8. a4, a very, very common move. And I'm asking you about common moves that are about standard ideas, like knight f1, knight g3, or knight f1, knight e3. Nuri Lopez, a4, space for the bishop 2. 
C3D4. Um, there are some specific uh, places for every single piece. If you know the position well. Not trying to find out that. The exchange here. Bishop takes f6. In general, I'm pretty sure this will never happen because uh, it was a strong pin. If we don't have uh, any benefits out of this deal. It currently seems like we have. What are the benefits to eliminate the knight shot? Let's go. It's a very, very easy benefit. Very easy. We need four. There we go. Bam, bam, bam. Easy game for Capablanca. Winning a pawn. Winning a pawn. Keep going with advantage. Trying to go for the f5 weak square. Queen h6. Oh, let's ask you some, some interesting question before the tournament. Yeah, I know. Uh, so, why g6 is so catastrophic? Hey, just for few. How are you doing? Feel free to join Arena, please. If you're interested to play 3 plus 2. 90 minutes so far. And then, match between number 1 and number 2. Short match. 3 out of 5. Why g6 is so catastrophic, chat? Why, 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 why? Yeah, this looks like uh, this looks like simple, simple, simple chess. Yeah, because this uh, this is already a discover. Open up the queen. Checkmate is coming, and also the next threat is such a kind of check. Just just a pawn. Yeah, just a pawn. So g six is totally forbidden. Queen h six. He exchanged the queens. I think this is a pretty easy game. The rest of the game will be just a technique. What we don't need to looking for even um but sometimes i'm i'm surprised of uh, some skills of me some skills of you chat so probably we just need to see how capablanca um finish the game successful with extra pawn d1 simplifying for sure simplifying soon look ed8 he's still extra pawn yeah h4 start pushing we have a connected pass pawn very often you forgot about that you've been distracted and you play something else a5 g3 96 boom simplification is the next step 93 we don't need this poor bishop rook db8 94 king d7 um Rook c1, rook a7. Rook is having uh, not really well coordinated pieces. We try to go for pushing more pawns, of course, or directly attacking here, or a good outpost like that. It will be very, very comfortable position for white and very easy to win it. Rook b4. You see, he doesn't wish to exchange so many pieces. Hurry up to push, of course. Um, rook c3. Bishop c5, rook f3. I think one minute. Uh, one minute uh, for that. <laughs> for tournament. King g7. Push. Bishop d4. Bishop is very, very weak. Uh, g5, rook a6. h5, push. He decided to sacrifice because tie hands. That's it. Push to the end. And this rule is gonna... Eliminate totally 